Hello everyone and welcome back to the intro to Unreal Engine 4 tutorial series. In this video I'm going to cover how to download and install um, both the Unreal Engine and the Epic Launcher, which you'll need to install that. And I'm going to cover a little bit about the marketplace and some of the free content you can grab. Um, so to get started, just go to unrealengine.com and at the top right you'll see a download button. It'll ask you what type of license you want. Um, I would recommend going with the publishing one in case you do want to release your game. Um, it doesn't really matter, but this is what I generally would recommend. Uh, it'll ask you to log in or sign up. You can use your Google account or any, a number of other accounts. Um, once you are logged, or once you do kind of sign up, it'll ask you to agree that you agree to all this stuff. And it'll start downloading down here the installer. Um, you click the installer, and that will bring oh you know open up the installer. Install it wherever you want. That's the default location. I already have this installed. So what is, what it is installing is the Epic Launcher. I'll skip to showing you what that is. So once that installed, it'll it'll install this program for you, which is the launcher. Um, there's a few things to look at here. Home page is kind of just uh, mostly new. Now that the Epic Launcher does include a store as well, so it does have a lot of um, game store stuff. If you want to turn that off, you can go to settings and turn off all these show free games. Uh, um, and hide the, the other parts. But what we're really going to need is the Unreal Engine tab here. So we just go to Unreal Engine and here you can add the different engines. You can press the plus sign and select whichever version you want. Um, currently when I'm recording this we're using 4.24 and 4.25 is about to be released. Uh, you can install either one, it doesn't really matter. And you can choose what your default launch one is here if you hit the little drop down. Uh, when you do launch it uh, I'll get to the project creation in the next video, so I'll keep it short, but when you do create your projects, they will show up here in the My Projects section. And then when you get um, content from the Marketplace, it'll show up here in the Vault section. And when you want to add the content that you've got to a project, you can just say Add to Project and choose a project. Um, so speaking of the Marketplace, that's still in this tab under uh, Unreal Engine. So we go to Marketplace, and there's a lot of free stuff. You can check out all the cool paid stuff too, but um, just to kind of have some assets to work with, and I'll, I'll probably refer to some of them in these tutorials, you can go ahead and grab the free stuff. Epic Games makes has some really good stuff, obviously, that they've given away. Um, they have full characters, and you know these are really good just for testing characters. There's a free for the month section, so grab those. It doesn't download to your um, local computer until you tell it to, so you can go ahead and just buy everything that's free, or you know, add it to your cart and buy it. There's a permanently free collection. So just so you know, that's stuff you can use to kind of start learning with. Um, there's also this Learn tab here. Start guides, um, get started with Unreal is pretty good. If you're an artist or a level designer or a programmer, you can check these out. Um, and there's just more tutorials. And one of the best things is this content example. I would recommend downloading this. Um, it's free. It'll show up in your library once you get it. And you can kind of look at different content examples of things you might be able to do within the engine. And that way you can kind of you know reverse engineer or at least get a glimpse of what's possible. Um, so that's pretty much all I wanted to cover with this. Um, in the next video, I'll go over how to create a project, your first project, how to um, import some stuff from the marketplace, and then we'll go from there. All right, I'll see you later.